video. I uh, just wanted to show you. These here are the uh, NUMA Point Ballistic Shades. Hey YouTubers, got a uh, pair of shades here I uh, wanted to show off uh, from NUMA. Um, bought my first pair of NUMAs in uh, 2009 and I've, uh, I've had them about three years. It's the longest I've ever had a pair of shades. I absolutely love these things. I fell in love with them. Um, the only problem was they discontinued this model and uh, as you see they got some good wear on them I mean I, I wore them probably every day of the year um, every day that I owned them I should say um, since I bought them and I absolutely love them but I kind of put them in retirement like I said they're kind of getting worn and um, uh, I, I didn't want to uh, completely uh, trash them I kind of use them as a, as a backup backup to backup to backup um, they're really nice, came in this case right here. So but when I started seeing they were wearing out and I wanted to put them in retirement, I knew I had to get another pair because, like I said, I love NUMA. In fact, um, there are, there's a lot of great companies out there making sunglasses. Um, out of all the companies out there, NUMA is my favorite. I love NUMA. Um, so here it comes in a nice rigid case. Um, kind of uh, pros and cons either case. This one here is a lot smaller. It's kind of nice. I actually had this thing here hooked on the, uh, the shifter of my truck, so it just kind of stayed there. I always had a rag or um, extra lenses. Came with extra lenses. So kind of like this. But I do like the fact that this is rigid. Um, a little bit bigger. Not as easy to carry with you. Um, but if you want to carry with you, it does have this uh, you know little case right here. So got the uh, decal here. Warning: not fragile. Kind of funny. Um, here are the lenses, here's the new ones. Uh, these are the uh, Point Ballistic. And I kind of like the design of these better than my original. As much as I love the originals, uh, on occasion the lenses would pop out if I uh, dropped them. Um, they did at first, but after you know, I, I wore them after a couple years, they started to pop out a little bit easier. These are in here pretty solid. These aren't going to pop out. You can remove them, and it does come with extra lenses. This here is the Mandarin. This here is the clear. This one is the smoke. Um, so it does come with extra lenses. To pop out, um, it's not exactly an easy operation, um, but I'm, I'm, kind of, you know, I'm kind of glad it's not easy. But uh, to pop out, you just kind of lift up and push forward. You pop out like that. Then you get them in there. You put it in the bottom and lift up on the frame. Push them in. Um, like I said, it's, it's not exactly an easy operation, but to me that just means they're in there really firm. So, um, kind of like the fact that this nose piece right here is part of the frame, so you don't have to worry about you know that little nose bridge coming off or anything like that. Uh, the nose piece right here is uh, no slip tack rubber, as are the uh, right here. Um, the uh, what do you call it here? Let me look, the uh, temple pads. Couldn't think there. Comes in black. I kind of like the desert tan. Just kind of me. I guess all all shades come in black, so I like to be a little bit different. Um, these here have uh, flex frame technology. Uh, they're made to be bent, smashed, um, whatever. You can go on their website and watch a, a dude take a swing with a golf club doing one of these things and the lenses do pop out if I remember correctly on the video but they're completely unharmed you put them back in good to go these I don't even think the lenses would pop out on these um, this is a different model he did it with on the video but these things are ultra tough in fact they come with a lifetime warranty uh, according to their, their warranty it's uh, the warranty covers everything uh, pretty much like no questions asked um, so that's pretty sweet. Not a lot, I don't know if there's a lot of shades to do that. Um, uh, it is uh, anti-scratch, anti-fog. 
uh, has the coating on there. Exceeds impact tests of ANSI uh, Z87.1 and MIL PRF31013. Um, as I said, it comes with three lenses, smoke, high camp, contrast mandarin, and clear. Uh, the case is ballistic nylon. Uh, pretty nice, rigid case, like I said. Um, oh, lenses are 100% uh, UV, and they are uh, prescription available. And um, just a little bit of background on NUMA. Uh, it was founded by a Special Forces soldier and a triathlete, um, uh, Jake Bennett. And I've, I've emailed him. I've, I've corresponded with him a little bit over email. Uh, great guy. Um, definitely, you know, obviously he's uh, special forces, so he's definitely pro-military. He, he does give uh, a military discount. Just send him an email. Um, but uh, according to the storyline here, it said, you know, he kind of noticed pretty much all the gear they use is pretty rugged and tough, except for the sunglasses. So he was determined to build the wor world's first non-fragile pair of eyewear. Um, he launched a company in the summer of 07. Um, and uh, the rest is history. It, and uh, these are some extremely tough sunglasses, which is why I really like them. And they are, um, as you notice here also, another thing, they are wrap around, so they're not going to come off your face. I've, I've jogged in mine, um, uh, even my old pair, uh, jog, ran, I shoot in them. I mean, I, I always have these things on. When I'm, um, when I leave the house, I, I always, as I said in some of my other videos, I always have on a pair of shades. Um, and for, you know, almost three years, it was these uh, Numas right here. And uh, now these have taken its place as my uh, favorite shades. Like I said, there's, you know, there's a lot of other shades I like. I did, I've done reviews on many sunglasses. Love all the other ones I've done. Um, but these are my favorite. So, uh, if you haven't tried Numa Tactical, I highly recommend it. Um, you can uh, just go to their website, send them an email. You'll probably, like, like as was the case with me, you'll probably get an email response back from Jake, uh, the owner, founder of the company. Um, so, he's a good guy to talk to. So, um, go ahead and check them out uh, when you get a chance if you're in the market for a new pair of shades. So, always, if you have any questions, let me know. Semper Fi.